Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. In today's video I'm going to be trying for the first time the NYX Shine Loud Magic Maker Lipstick. For the people who don't know me, my name is Leonor, I'm a makeup artist, a makeup lover and a makeup enthusiast and here in my channel you can always find videos about makeup. And today I'm going to be trying for the first time this lipstick the NYX Shine Louder Magic Maker. I'm really excited to see if it's as good as everyone says on TikTok, if this lipstick is really good or not, if it has a good duration. I'm going to be trying it with you and I'm also going to do a wear test of this lipstick. I'm going to come back in the end of the day, show you how it's looking, what I thought about it, if it had a good duration or not. So this video has everything you need to know about this one. This lipstick was a trend on TikTok and since then I wanted to try it so much. If you saw the video where I do the unbox where I bought this product, you know that I already had this product, but I lost it and I've never tried it. So I decided to buy it again and tried it. And of course, I'm going to do that all with you for you to know my opinion, my first opinion, what I thought about the lipstick, if it's as good as everyone says, because if it went viral on TikTok, of course, that a lot of people like it. So here we have the lipstick. I'm really excited to see if it's good. And before we try it, I'm going to talk to you a little bit about the lipstick, what the brand says about this one. So they say, Shine Loud with Her First Ultra Pigment Eye Shine Lip Color. Available in 30 bold shades, this dual-handed lipstick delivers bold color up to 16 hours of transfer resistant wear plus the two-step technology is easy to use. Simply swipe on the pigment packed base coat for a pop of loud color. Let's try, then add the top coat, a long-lasting lip gloss for a non-sticky finish. Base coat is infused with lip-loving oils including macadamia seed oil, coriander fruit oil, jojoba seed oil, apricot kernel oil and passionate fruit seed oil. Meanwhile, the ultra glossy top coat contains vitamin E derivative. The transfer proof lip color delivers up to 16 hours of wear as I already told you. Shine lip gloss top coat blows an ultra reflective non-sticky finish. No budge, no bleed, no fade formula stands up to kissing, drinking, hair flipping and more. Lightweighted and comfy on the lips, double sized lip gloss comes with separate applicators for base and top coats and it's a vegan product. The color that I bought is the SLHP05, I think that is the 05 color and the 05 they say that it's magic maker. I have a little bit of Vaseline on my lips, I'm going to take it out so we can apply the lipstick. To apply this product we have two steps. First the color and then the gloss. So what they say is apply the lipstick, <laughs> of course. Let me just take the excess of the product of the applicator. This is the color applicator. It's different from the other applicators that I'm used to. I don't know, let's see how it applies. Oh, I'm really liking the color. It's a beautiful one. Just going to apply it on my hand so you can see better because of course that on the lips it can look different. They say to wait uh, 90 seconds or to wait until it's not uh, sticking. So while I'm doing that I'm going to show you how it looks the color here on my hand. I think that it's a beautiful color it's like a peachy, but more brownish one. So beautiful. 
I am loving it. I'm just going to let it dry a little bit so we can apply the other part of the lipstick. But I really have to say that the color looks beautiful. So I'm going to apply the gloss part. This one will give us like shiny lipstick. Very glossy, very beautiful. I want to see how the lip gloss uh, looks uh, during the day because normally glosses I don't really like. Normally they stick to the hairs. Today I have mine tied up, but normally when I have my hair loose down, normally the hairs stick to the glosses so I hope that it doesn't but in terms of the feeling that this one gives to the lips it's very good it's not that kind of gloss that it's sticky when you do this it's not sticky for the first impressions I'm really liking it what I felt uh, before I applied this one this part glues a little bit when you are touching your lips so I really think this one is going to give you a more comfortable finish. You are going to feel more comfortable because this part, it really sticks. But I'm really loving how the lips are looking. They are very juicy, very beautiful. The color is amazing. And as I told you, the feeling that I'm having with the gloss is good. So I really want to know how it looks in the end of the day, see how I feel with this one on my lips. So I'm going to come back in the end of the day, show you how it's looking so you can see what I thought about the lipstick, if it had a good duration as well, because they say that this one has 16 hours, so it's a good amount of hours on the lips. I want to see if that's true or not. Of course, that I'm going to be eating and drinking and all of that. It's now 10.30 in the morning, so I'm going to be having my lunch, my snacks, my dinner, and then I'm going to come back and show you how the lips are looking, how the lipstick lasted during the day. For the moment, I think that's all I have to say to you. I like how it's looking. I like how it's feeling. Let's see if it really has a good duration, as they say. I'll come back in the end of the day. I am back to show you how the lipstick is looking, how it lasts during the day. It's been nine hours, nine and a half hours since I'm wearing this lipstick. I think that you can see I still have all the lipstick on my lips and I hate my lunch, I hate my snack in the afternoon. I drink a lot of tea and water and it's still here, so I'm really, really happy with this lipstick. Of course, that the gloss part, I don't have it on my lips. I don't have it for a while. So like if you want your lips to look shiny and all of that, you have to put this one more times than this one in here. If you are like me and you prefer to use a matte lipstick, you can just apply it the first time and then don't apply it more. The gloss part, it went away after I ate my lunch, but I was expecting that because it's a gloss. Of course, it's not going to be on your lip all day or anything like that, but the color really did. As I told you, it's been nine and a half hours. It's a lot of time eating, drinking, and it didn't go anywhere, so I'm really happy with the lipstick. I think that it's an amazing one. I understand now why TikTok and everyone on TikTok love this one so much, because look, it's still here. It's been here for almost 10 hours and it didn't came out. The color still looks beautiful. So what more I have to say? 10 hours is a lot for a lipstick. Look at my lips. They still have a lot of color, so I really have to say that I'm happy with this one. I think I'm going to have to grab some more colors for me to have because, look, it looks beautiful. I applied the color part and then I felt like when I was doing this, it glued and then I applied this one and the gloss wasn't that sticky one, so I felt like so comfortable. After the gloss went away, I didn't feel like this one glued anymore. Really happy with that. 
because normally we don't want our matte lipsticks gluing when we are talking, like our lips to glue to each other when we are talking. And I think that I'm going to grab this one so much because of durability, but also because of the color. This color is so beautiful. It's like a pinkish, peachy brown. Now I want to know what you thought about the video, if you liked it or not, if you already knew this lipstick, if you already tried it, what you think about this one, if it's a good one or not. So go down there in the comments area and tell me everything. And if you like this video and you don't want to miss any of my other videos here on my YouTube channel, don't forget to also go down there and click on the subscribe button and also on the ring bell so you can get all the notifications when I upload a new video. And if you like this one, don't forget to also give it a thumbs up. I'm also going to leave down there the other social media that I use, so you can go there and follow me as well. Now that we are in the end of the video, I just want to thank you so much for being here, for watching my video until the end. I really hope that you like this one, and now I hope to see you on my next one. Bye!